Located on the left bank of the River Seine in central Paris, the Materials and Quantum Phenomena Physics Laboratory, or MPQ, is a research facility jointly run by Paris Diderot University and the CNRS National Scientific Research Center. The laboratory brings together staff from industrial laboratories and Paris-based fundamental research teams. Their common concern is to develop quantum devices for new technologies by exploring the fundamental aspects of matter at nanometer scale. Behind each research project carried out at MPQ is a device using new functions based on quantum effects. This was the unifying idea that guided MPQ's development when it was set up in the early part of the new century with a deliberate focus on three related themes nanomaterials and self-ordering, molecular scale electronics, and quantum photonics, all of which require close links with a technology platform. Building devices and observing quantum effects in matter involves working with complex technology through partnerships with teams both outside the university and on its technology platform. An on-campus cleanroom provides researchers with an essential development facility to help them rapidly close the loop between the design and the characterization of the devices. Also, the MPQ has been equipped with a very high-resolution electron microscope that is unique in the Greater Paris area. It's available for research work in conjunction with other laboratories. Knowledge of matter and its intimate atomic structures contributes to the understanding of quantum behavior as observed by research teams. When we can get down to the atomic level using sophisticated instruments, we can study some of the most fundamental aspects of matter. It means we can understand how new carbon nanotube and fullerene-based hybrid materials work. We can also create magnetically charged nano-objects obtained by controlled growth to create original devices. And by studying these, we can develop the ultra-dense data storage devices of tomorrow. At very low temperatures, in addition to superconductors, multiferroics are also highly promising materials, notably for the electronics of the future. We can uncover the properties of these materials through the interaction of photons with matter. Our aim is to explore and analyze them for an enhanced understanding of quantum phenomena. Studied at temperatures close to absolute zero, the devices we're developing here help us to better understand the electricity conducting properties of molecular scale objects. These are the future components of molecular electronics that already have a number of applications. Light is studied in all its states. Non-linear microcavity devices generate exotic frequencies and quantum light states such as pairs of twin photons. By using an optomechanical coupling, microcavities can also detect very small forces. Infrared sensors derived from quantum engineering generate thermal images. Quantum cascade lasers, which helped forge MPQ's reputation, produce unconventional frequencies for spectroscopic applications ranging from environmental surveillance to analytic imaging. We 
also design ultra-stable terahertz femtosecond pulse devices used to study mixed light matter states for efficient nano antenna arrays. Ion traps we've created in conjunction with the laboratory's technical staff will help us to create a device to process quantum data. By laser cooling trapped ions, we can control their quantum state. This leads to an organization in chains where single ions occupy precisely defined positions. It marks the first stage on the road to a future quantum memory. Theoretical research teams at MPQ study quantum systems in unconventional regimes to develop theoretical methodology. The aim is to explore new concepts in fundamental physics, to design new functionalities and interact with other experimental research teams across disciplines. MPQ is a young, fast-growing laboratory where excellence is the watchword. Each year about 50 reference publications and 100 conference presentations link the laboratory to the international scientific community. MPQ staff have responsibilities at every level of Paris Diderot University. The university's current chancellor, for example, is one of the founder members of the laboratory. The laboratory's reputation builds on its ties with industrial partners and its numerous research contracts, which also ensure that it's in tune with the contemporary world around it. Each year, the laboratory's interdisciplinary teams host some 30 postgraduate students. Cooperation programs with countries throughout Europe and Asia, the United States and Latin America both contribute to the transmission of knowledge and stimulate innovation for future research. MPQ is a host structure for students from all over the world. Here they find highly motivated staff and administrative personnel dedicated to ensuring that research takes place in the best possible conditions. The scientific policy laid down by the laboratory's governing council defined the strategic choices that have positioned MPQ at the cutting edge of contemporary research. Resolutely forward-looking, the MPQ laboratory aims to play an active role in shaping a new vision of society, notably by helping to design the new technologies that will one day underpin the inevitable use of quantum effects in devices of all kinds.